What's up? How are you guys today? Another Monday at Frankie's Free Range Meat. I did want to apologize for the background noise because I forgot my microphone, so you guys get to hear what I hear every day. And a couple exciting things happening this week. Main thing for me is uh, we just did some roast beef yesterday, sold out within like half an hour. I'll try to get some more for you guys. We'll show you that real quick, so. So, it's cooked rare. We have it in the fridge right now, guys. It's actually pink, it's just, yeah, you know, because of the natural oxidation, it looks a little gray right now. Every step along the way, you know, organic pepper, land salts, cooked in steel, minimal contact with plastic. But again, guys, this is all sold out. So as of this video posting, I will list some more roast beef, maybe 25 or 30 portions. It's probably going to sell out by the time you guys check it, but uh, just something nice I want to show you guys. Maybe we'll get the ovens, maybe we won't, and we'll try to do it. It's just, you know, you can't go to the supermarket and get 100% grass-fed roast beef, and I thought this was something special uh, to keep you guys uh, entertained. And we also have the collagen broth back in stock that is, you know, very gelatinous like my cameraman's brain. Uh, my guys are also gonna be doing some chicken stock this week, and it's gonna be more of a culinary thing, like, you know, the roast beef, chicken stock, culinary, collagen broth is more of like a supplement, although you could still, like, add that collagen broth after you cook a soup to just add more of, you know, the gelatinous texture to it. And, you know, online, roast beef, grass-fed is, you know, around $28 a pound. So that was the price reference I used. And the difference between you know, what we're selling and those other roast beefs is, those other ones taste like shit, you know. I, I bought one from Whole Foods once and I, it was inedible. Like, I, I've, I've never bought something from Whole Foods that I couldn't actually eat. That was, that was the first. I literally just had two slices, spit it out, never bought it again. So, if you guys want to try that roast beef, maybe we'll try to do it more consistently. Maybe I'll get some ovens in here, but uh, let me know how you guys like it if you do get the chance to try it. So, my guys are on lunch break right now. You know, there's a lot of stuff going on in general. Uh, they finished most of the orders today. Uh, we got some more printed out because we sold the roast beef yesterday. We got the post office orders this week that my cameraman has done an excellent job of filling. And uh, the guy that was fixing the, the Hobart mixer, uh, he brought it back. You know, he polished it up nice, put new screws in. I mean, it's still a used piece of equipment. You know, he's got mineral oil all over. It's not going to rust anymore. So this means we're going to be making uh, those apple, banana, macadamia nut bars this week. Hopefully, you know, I put the dried fruit through here and it works. I mean, I've never tried it before, but I'm assuming a meat grinder can do dried fruit. I guess we'll find out. So let's hop in the freezer real quick and uh, hopefully it's not too loud. You guys know we have the, the three pound beef suet fat available. Uh, I didn't put these back in stock yet, but as of this video, we will have one pound portion lamb hearts. We have a lot of beef belly, so this week for the free giveaway, you know, it's been bison the past few months now, I think. Uh, we're gonna do one pound beef belly, so all orders placed this week, probably next week too, maybe not. You guys are gonna get one pound of beef belly to try out. We do have a new product this week that will not be sold out. Veal, testicles, fries, whatever you like to call them. We're gonna have some more goat in. I think we might have some goat left, but you guys know they have naturally occurring testosterone. You have you know, maybe one or two every week. These are portioned one or two pounds. So you guys have options there. And I bought some sweet breads accidentally, uh, the thymus gland at a price that was way too high. And I wouldn't have, but we were able to get some lower priced ones back in stock. So we have one pound sweet breads available as well as the larger two pound portion. So whichever one you guys decide to buy, I've, I've kind of compensated the price a little bit and it's back to something normal. So we got plenty of those. Hopefully we move through them pretty quickly. For the most part, we have everything. We're gonna get a shipment of lamb fat this week. I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for that. All of the chicken, the chicken parts are back in stock. So as I've said every week, guys, if there's anything you would like, leave me a comment down below, send me an email, let me know. And as always, if you've had a problem with your order, just again, send me an email. We will sort things out. We won't focus too much on the negative this week. Still dealing with the nonsense with the Con Ed bill, 
I don't know what's going on with them, my lawyer, my landlord, no one wants to help me basically, so hopefully we can figure that out within the next few weeks before Con Edison threatens to turn the power off. And I know someone from Con Edison is watching this, you're all still a bunch of fucking cocksuckers. Wi-Fi shielding, Frankie's Naturals. Uh, I gotta text my tailor to see what's up with the clothes, when they'll be ready. I, I thought they'd be done by now, but uh, I guess we can go downstairs and take a look. We got plenty of bubble wrap, maybe I can wrap up my camera and roll them down the street. That'll knock some sense into them, especially if he gets run over by a few cars. I'm still waiting for Mountain Valley to come in fat ass check. You know, I bet you, as soon as Frank Tefano started talking about Mountain Valley, their, their sales and profits went up at least 20%. 20% across the board, gross revenue. Oregon supplements, nothing new yet, guys. I'm gonna try to make that magnesium oil without the MSM this week, uh, but we still do have plenty of the magnesium oil with MSM. This is one of the main things that has, has prevented me from getting headaches. Every time I used to drive down, come down here every day for the most part, my head would hurt a little bit, but if I use this magnesium, no more. Of course, the master gum that I take with every single meal. A lot of you guys ask me if I still use the glandulars. I do take the third eye a couple times a week, the pineal, just to try it out. If I can remember to do it, uh, we have the macronutrient and carnivore enzyme blends that, you know, if you're having digestive issues, temporarily using them. I don't use them anymore, but I did for quite a few months. The male virility, which is the beef testes, is the option if you guys don't want to have the actual like raw goat testicles, raw veal, lamb testicles, whatever it is. So the main things I would say to use consistently for me, the male virility, if you're not having testicles, and the third eye. Small amount of omega-3, but mainly for the you know, the cellular properties of having the same gland. Wi-Fi shielding Frankie's natural is nothing to update you guys on, but I do want to thank you guys for continuously supporting me. Hopefully it eventually pays off despite all of the uh, setbacks and stuff, but you guys can go to frank stefanocom to check out all of these businesses, Frankie's Syringe Meat, Frankie's Syringe Foods, Organ Supplements, Frankie's Naturals, Wi-Fi Shielding, and we have frank stefanocom as well. We have the the bodybuilding workout course, carnivore diet course, you guys can schedule consultations with me. And the reason I'm saying that is because I get emails like every day asking if I do consultations. I don't really talk about it enough, so check that out guys, frank stefanocom But if you could please drop a like on the video, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Thanks again for joining me guys, and I will see you for tomorrow.